Now there's a few easy ways to create bullet points in Photoshop, but the first thing you need to do is select your type tool by pressing T and then just click and drag out on your canvas like so to create a text box. This just makes life a lot easier when it comes time to format all of your bullet points. Now the first way to add a bullet point is by using a keyboard shortcut. On a Mac, just press option and eight. And if you're on a Windows computer, then I'll leave that shortcut up on the screen right now as I don't wanna get those numbers messed up. Anyways, once you've used that shortcut, you can begin typing whatever you want for that bullet point. Then when it comes time to add a second bullet point, you can just press enter and then repeat the process. Now, another way of adding a bullet point is just by copying and pasting the bullet point that I added in the description below. Just copy and paste that into Photoshop and then you'll be good to go. Now, the final way that you can add bullet points is using glyphs. Now, glyphs can be found across all of your different fonts, but there's one font in particular that has a ton of interesting bullet point styles, which is called Wingdings. So to access your glyphs panel, just go to window and down here to glyphs. And then we wanna set our font down to wingdings. Then within the glyphs panel of wingdings, you can see that there's a bunch of bullet points here that you can choose from and they're all a little bit more unique than this little black dot. To add those bullet points, all you have to do is just double click on that glyph and it will add that bullet point in there. Again, you can click on any of these options and you'll get a few different styles depending on what you're wanting. Just remember that when you go back to type your sentence that follows the bullet point, you'll need to change your font back in the options bar to your desired font for your list. In this case, I'm just going to delete this and show you one final tip for formatting your list to make sure everything looks super nice. I'm gonna once again use my keyboard shortcut option eight since I'm on a Mac, and then I'll type in a second line of text. Currently, the second lines in my list are formatted over and I would like them all to be even with the first line of text. So we can do that using our paragraph formatting settings. To access those settings, just go to window and down here to paragraph. And then within the first indent option, we'll hover over that icon and we can just adjust this over like so, and then click on our next line and do the same thing here as well. That way all of our text has a nice even line across the entire thing. And I'm just lining it up to the edge of my text box here. And it doesn't really matter that any of the bullet points are outside of the text box because they're still gonna be visible. So even when I go and grab the move tool, I can select that and now move this list anywhere I want and it remains formatted. So that is how you create bullet points in Photoshop. And if this helped you to create your bullet points, make sure to hit that like button down below.